Part 2 This video part has the purpose of listing some of the major bones of the head and shoulders so that you'll have a better understanding of the upper body anatomy. In this sketch, the intricate structure of the bones will become easier to comprehend when I tint the bones in watercolor. Once again, I will explain the bones and joints you need to know. For tinting bones, I will use a watercolor set and a soft squirrel brush. There will be just a single color used for tinting. Such a technique is called grisaille. If you are sketching during this video lesson, this step is completely optional. The cranium section is located above the red line on this drawing and the facial bones are below. In the front, there is the frontal bone which forms the forehead and upper walls of the eye sockets. 